Welcome to this Selenium Java tutorial on Selenium Java screenshot and try catch Java statement. A screenshot is an image of the screen in a given state. It is quite simple to take a Selenium screenshot Java. Let me show you how. I will show you the Selenium screenshot code in Maxtaf Cloud, the free Selenium framework using Java. So in Maxtaf I created a free account using my email address and created a project and then created a case. Now I can start modifying the case. I have to modify the test method. I will use Selenium WebDriver to take screenshot of this demo web application. But you can take a screenshot in Selenium of any website. Actually it is common to take Selenium screenshot on failure. For that you can put the Selenium screenshot code along with your assertion. Now in my case in the test method I just have a couple of statements driver.manage.window.maximize to maximize the browser window and in driver.get I put the link of the demo web application that I just showed you. You can also get this link in this video description at the bottom. Now in order to take the screenshot I have to write a couple of import statements now this is the first import statement takes screenshot this is a selenium interface that has the selenium screenshot method the other import statement is for the output type this is the selenium interface to get the screenshot in bytes or file now let me start writing the code now in the test method I'm going to put a single line comment how to take screenshot in selenium I want to save the screenshot in bytes output type so I can create a byte array after byte put square brackets and I'm going to call my screenshot variable name as s the byte s is equal to now here I can put driver now before driver I can use a takes screenshot interface so that I can use typecasting now the type of driver is changed to takes screenshot now this whole thing now has a get screenshot as method so if I put a dot I can get screenshot as and in the target I can give output type dot bytes and end the statement with a semicolon. Next I'll put another single line comment how to capture screenshot in selenium web driver now maxstaff has uh, a built in mx service so mx service has a method called save screenshot and the name of the screenshot variable above is s that is the code to take the screenshot so let me save it and compile it the case is compiled, same testing, click on the run button, run, let us see how to take screenshot in Selenium web driver. The Maxstaff cloud has started the case execution, it is going to open the browser window, navigate to that demo web application link or any other link and take the screenshot. Now you should be familiar with this run log these are the run details here and one additional thing that comes here is a screenshot and here we can see the thumbnail of the screenshot if you double click on it it will show you the complete screenshot you should understand try catch finally java statement 
actually during execution java may get an error so this error during execution is called an exception so when you write java code that may throw an exception you should use the java try catch first you put try then you put the code block this is the code that has to be protected during execution if java throws an exception because the code is in the code block java will not stop the execution instead it will go to the catch block execute the exception handling code and continue that's how try catch in java works finally is optional in try catch statement java the java try catch finally block always executes whether there is any exception in the try block or not now let me show you try catch finally java statement so i'm going to close this run details and put this screenshot code in the try catch finally java statement i can put a single line comment try catch java example and i want to protect the code for taking the screenshot in the try catch finally statement so i can put try and then start this code block here and all these statements i can cut from here and put it in the try block because it may happen that there is a exception thrown during execution now after try catch and finally both are optional but at least one of them has to be put so i am going to first put the java try catch block i am going to put a single line comment java try catch block and here i have to write catch and within brackets give exception is the type of the variable and i'm going to call it e and within the curly braces give the exception block now i don't want to do anything else apart from printing out something so i can handle the exception by using system dot out dot print ln and just print there was an error now this is the catch block and this should also work so let us do selenium automation testing save it compile it and run it it is going to do the same thing as before it is going to take the screenshot there is not going to be any exception and just the try block will be executed the catch block will not be executed so here we can see as before there is a screenshots pane here and in console output the catch block has not printed because there was no exception now i will put finally block also in the try catch finally statement in java single line comment finally in java try catch statement and give the finally java keyword and within curly braces put the finally code block so here also i am going to put system dot out dot print ln statement now and finally i can put the test 
method is complete now let me run this code because i have implemented try catch and finally the code block of finally will always execute whether or not there is any exception so let us see that save it compile it and run it now because there is not going to be any exception the try block will be executed and then control will move to finally so we can see the screenshot here and in the console output where we can see the output of all the system dot out dot print ln the finally method is executed because it is printed the test method is complete and after finally also we can have code that is also a possibility so let me put a single line comment after try catch finally in java and here also i am going to put so a system dot out dot print ln and i'm going to print continued so this time if i run this java program what's going to happen is it's going to take the screenshot there is no not going to be any exception it will skip the catch block it will execute finally block and then continue the execution from this point so let us confirm that i'm saving it now compile and run this code in the selenium java tutorial the case execution is complete and now in the console output there should be output from the finally block which printed the test method is complete and it continued beyond the try catch finally statement so it's also printed continued so that was selenium automation testing in try catch program java with no exception now let me throw an exception so what i can do is uh, first i'll have to write an import statement for the exception so go to the top and write the import statement import i'm going to just import a simple exception library java.io.io exception and here i can write the throw statement so after the get screenshot as method i can write the throw statement which will force an exception throw new and i can give io exception now because the exception will be thrown the remainder of the code in the try block will not be executed so i can comment that out also save it compile it and selenium automation testing in try catch program java with an exception so what is going to happen is it is going to execute the try block then there is going to be an exception it will move to the catch block and print there was an error finally will always be executed and beyond finally whatever code block is there that will also be executed so this time we can see that there was no screenshots folder because the screenshot never got saved but in the console output so first the catch block printed there was an error then finally is always executed so it printed the test method is complete then it printed continued
so that's selenium java automation testing with try and catch in java when there is an exception and that is the control flow in try catch in this selenium web driver tutorial i explained how to capture screenshot java selenium web driver using max tab with selenium software using the interfaces takes screenshot in selenium and output type in selenium i also explained the control flow in try catch finally when using the try catch in java please like this selenium tutorial also view all my selenium tutorials you will learn selenium easily with my selenium training that starts from selenium tutorial for beginners thank you